So it's right around 2.05 a.m. on Sunday, um, April 3rd, and I'm making this video because I've been lying on my bed, fully awake, feeling perfectly fine for the last three hours. I actually just had a two and a half hour conversation with my mom on the phone, lying on my bed, and everything was quiet. There were no fumes or odors, and the radios in this bathroom were normal. And about 10 minutes ago, as soon as I tried to go into this bathroom to use the toilet, the psychopath, cyber criminal, sex offender, who lives in Unit 78 and who spends a lot of time on the other side of this wall, suddenly started getting really agitated, worked up, making noises on the other side of the wall, and blowing all kinds of fumes into this unit and into this bathroom. At the same time, my radio started making this really loud squealing noise. It wasn't doing that before. Um, the radios are perfectly quiet and normal up until the time that I tried to use um, the toilet in this bathroom. I cannot be in this bathroom right now because of the nonstop fumes coming from the resident and the bathroom of Unit 78. I don't know how this person knows when I'm about to use my toilet, but she does. And every single time I try to physically sit on that toilet, she suddenly becomes aggressively disruptive directly against the wall that's directly behind my toilet. And she did that just now. So again, as you just heard, my radios suddenly were making this really loud squealing and whistling noise. Um, they were not making that noise at all until I started to use my bathroom just now. And she also started blowing all kinds of marijuana fumes straight through the wall directly behind my toilet. At the same time, the water from my kitchen sink suddenly started making me sick as soon as I tried using it. I mean, you can't make this stuff up. So right now I'm running it because there's obviously some kind of contamination in the water that is making me sick. And I actually just had to go down the hall to the common bathroom to get fresh clean water from that tap because the water from that tap does not make me sick. The water from this tap here in my kitchen does. So there's a psychopath who lives in the bathroom of unit 78. And when I say live, I'm not exaggerating. She sits there and then waits for me to go into my bathroom and use my toilet. And then she becomes aggressive, intrusive, and disruptive. So right now I cannot be in that bathroom a, my radio suddenly started making this super loud squealing, whistling noise as soon as I went into my bathroom and started to use the toilet at the same time. The marijuana fumes coming from the bathroom of Unit 78 suddenly started filling my bathroom. And then when I came to this tap to try to wash my hands, all of a sudden the water started inducing the same exact set of sudden onset illness symptoms that it always does when there's somebody on the other side of the wall smoking something, making their presence known, making noises, etc. This person needs to be moved. I cannot use my bathroom for when I intend to use it or what I need to use it for because this person is constantly on the other side of the shared wall of my bathroom with her bathroom acting like a total nut job. So she's smoking stuff in there right now. She's causing the radios to start squealing. It's just unbelievable. And it happens every day.